We look like this now. Pretty dope. I hear an enemy. On the right. It's part of the chest, motherfucker. Yeah, it is. What the fuck? I was gonna leave you alone, you piece of shit. Where's his legs? Oh. Father, I brought him here. It's the destined one. Brother is not around. You can hand it over to him now. Brother will surely give up on his plan once it's returned. And then we will be a family again. You mischievous monkey. You dare to push your luck, but always have a way out. Only you came back at the wrong time. Are you not thinking straight, father? I brought the destined one here to save you! I may be unwell, but I am not blind. You are not blind yet. How can you say that to me? I went through flames to find the destined one for you. But you, father, don't you see? I should have locked my eyes out too. Damn. To save me from your pretense. <laughs> oh? Worry not, old born fool. I'll see you shortly. What the fuck? Oh, it's the baby! <laughs> you could have enjoyed a good show. Oh, it was a dude. You simply lack the taste. I should have just killed you all. My guise was perfect. No one could see a single flaw in it. How did you find out then? So where's the real one? Interesting. It's that little fox. I will find out if it's true after I hunt her down. But first, I should burn you two together and mix your ashes to honor your friendship. Entertainment. What the fuck? That can wait. To save him, you have to impress me first. What the fuck am I looking at? Jet Randy? Is that you? <laughs> that was so fast. So this is this boss can Go through a lot of my fucking attacks. Dude, stop with your fires, bro. There's so many effects. Phase. I'm not surprised. You cursed monkey. Wherever you go, you leave behind a ruined face. 
family. My son is defeated, but not vanquished. I am afraid he'll rise again soon. Well, uh, since it came into my possession, I have kept it in my stomach, uh, hidden from all. Something's gonna happen. Destined, deprived, it's all the same. Don't ever believe their bullshit. You are your choices, your causes and effects, not what you're called. Oh my god, we just let that happen? Thanks to this false death talisman. Poor Keeper. Seems his legacy was his only offer after all. Oh, why is you? What the fuck happened to you? Ugh. Wait, that's kind of dope at the same time. Yaksha King. What? Wonder not a single raindrop was fanned. It was your trick the whole time. <sighs> My bad, old bull. I was a bit delayed. You little rascal. I'll teach you a lesson on your parents' behalf. Wait, that form is dope. Okay, I have full health and everything. That's good. What the fuck? What the fuck? Do I have to go through phase one again? No, I don't. What the fuck is he doing? What? Oh. I need to transform. Not good. The Buddha said my flesh is core. So when the spring's existence, I am claw. Get his ass. Come on. Good. 
That was fucking easy. So much for that form. Ignore the first time I died. Still holding on. Despite it all. Does your vengeance weigh more than your family? Spit it out now, his relic! Oh shit, the mother. The real one. My king, I'm sorry for my weakness. I turned to them, but none offered help. My lady, forget it. I implore you to show mercy and spare my son. He is the last of the Yaksha's bloodline in the West. With an origin most tragic and twisted. Now, he poses a threat no more. Should you grant him mercy, I, Rakshasi, and the Balking shall retreat ourselves to secluded meditation. Along with our children, we will never leave the mountain again. He is our son. We will bear his punishment. If it pleases you, my plant in fan is also yours to take. Flames have paved my way. Through flames, I shan't stray. Vain was my flame for a revenge destined to stray. Their delight lies in our submission, kneeling and begging. You've atoned through deeds, Black Bear. Take this pair of eyes. You've served the righteous cause, Yellow Rat. These ears are yours. Your power has gathered immune, Yellow Rat. Keep this nose. You've endured hardships on the eye. Go with the town. And the bull, it is the hardest to turn against a sworn brother. You can have his body.
football. You know, luck plagues your every step. <laughs> Never have you made a good choice. is plain, just like my own. They forced me to drink from the river of childbearing, to bear that boy in my womb. If not for that monkey, we could have lived our separate lives in peace. As if none of this had happened. You're cute. You knew who I was from the start. Why did you choose to be their lapdog? I never wanted to sever our ties. If kinship means anything to you, give me that relic. And let me avenge my people.
The Akshas are the mightiest of the eight legions, after all. Be your body hard as metal, meeting death in scores is inevitable. Yet, why did you endure the fish and those carts just as poorly? <laughs> you rush like wind with a clouded mind. It's your desires that shape what you see. Had your mind been less unsettled, would you still have fallen for that child's play? Haste oft blinds while patience illumines. Next time, can you still fulfill as Wukong without budge? To subdue the Bull King, the Jade Emperor issued an edict. Nerja, with the incinerating wheels, the Gwai slaying sword, and the coiling tether, and his father with the sealing pagoda and the revealing glass. Combining their strengths, they mustered a host of immortals who fought the Bull King and narrowly defeated him. Amid Wukong's rampage through the court, he toppled Lord Lao's pill furnace. A few bricks bearing remnant flames fell here and became the Flaming Mountains. Lord Lao blamed the furnace tending boy for his negligence and banished him to become the keeper of this place. As the Bull King collapsed, he cast a glance behind as if catching a glimpse of his deepest fear. The red boy coming to claim his life with the five elemental carts and the valiant six. He wished this day would never come, yet also longed for its swift arrival. Before the journey, Wukong lived free and easy. He wandered the lands and befriended the mighty. He had six sworn brothers, the Bull King among them. The monkey and the bull both called themselves great sages. They were two of a kind. As for their parting of ways and hard-fought strife, those are tales for another time. Alright, that was probably by far the best cutscene so far. Maybe chapter 6 will do better, but yeah. Um, let's see what we got. Grieved body. Um, got nimble body, which reduces stamina cost of all charged heavies. Everlasting vitality, which increases max health. And divine safeguard, which increases 4 beam resistance. I think I gotta go with the max health. Okay, alright, with that... We completed chapter 5 in under 4 hours. Very short chapter, a lot easier to manage. I didn't really get lost, and we're just left with next chapter, which is the final chapter, I believe. The The final boss is kind of simple for some reason. I don't know why. He he has some moves that just, if you fuck it up or let him do, it's just you're, you're dead, but it's kind of disappointing for his final phase. All right, with that, we're done. Until next time, I'll see you on chapter six, the final chapter, and we'll see how long it takes us to finish it. But until then, I'll see you then.